Down in Brainerd, four local veterans organizations are teaming up to serve a traditional Thanksgiving meal for the community. Clayton Castle has that story. Turkeys are in the fridge, pies are set out, and it's time for some Thanksgiving eating at the Brainerd American Legion. Tomorrow, the Brainerd American Legion, VFW, Eagles, and Elks will be teaming up to provide Thanksgiving dinner for any and everyone in the community. Last year, they served in excess of 700 people between the people that showed up here to eat as well as the, the shut-ins where meals were delivered. So hopefully this year we will exceed that. Between 11.30 and 1, a traditional Thanksgiving meal will be served at the American Legion on Front Street in Brainerd. In addition, those who are unable to make it down to the Legion, food will be delivered as well. There's a couple places where we're going to be delivering 40 meals. Um, and there's one where there's 20 going. And these are housing developments in town, lower income. Uh, housing developments. We deliver a lot of meals, take out meals to them. Another important sect of the community will be making the deliveries on behalf of the organizers. Enter the police and fire department. By them delivering, it's another presence for them to show people they're there, they're available, not only in times of distress or need, but also to give back to the community. Now obviously turkey will be the main food served here at the dinner, but the community will also be able to enjoy other tasty treats. They have more pies than you can shake a stick at. Uh, I bet there's about 40 pies back there, if not more. Uh, there's dressing, uh, there's green bean casserole, uh, mashed, garlic mashed potatoes, milk, coffee, bread. It's a traditional Thanksgiving meal. In the end, it's all about the veterans giving back to the community. Oh, it, it's just um, personal enjoyment, and it's a lot of fun. And you get to meet a lot of nice people. Reporting in Brainerd, Clayton Castle, Lakeland News. Any donations received during the event will be donated to the Salvation Army Food Shelf. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.